Hello, this is Brenda Dean, and today I'm going to show you a neat trick on how to uh, take this sentiment and the round tab punch and actually make it a little smaller than what you normally would. If you notice here, it would be quite large, but we actually want it smaller and resembling the bone for the doghouse today. So. What I'm going to do is I'm first going to punch it and I'm going to align the top where I kind of want it. You can see I'm trying to make it center it a little bit. And when I find the way I like it, I punch. And then what I'm going to do is take a piece of ordinary paper, just, just copy paper, and I'm going to stick it onto the paper because we're kind of going to use this as a carrier. Okay, so then what I'm going to do is take my punch and stick it back into my punch. Oops, I put it a little bit too far over, so we'll move it over a little bit. So I'm going to stick it back into my punch and line it up again. And you can see that this time I'm going much narrower. So I'll punch it, and you can see how I have a little extra. Wow, that looks like some fangs, doesn't it? But here is my final. It looks just like a little bone, and so when I put it on my card, that will complete it.